going into freshman year, I was, I was telling my dad, I was like, the ideal internship for me is to do a winter term internship at the Golf Channel so I can be in Orlando where it's warm and I can practice and at the Golf Channel because that's where I've always wanted the internship. And then, where we both said like, yeah, that's a nice dream, but that'll never happen. This past winter, that freshman year dream became a reality when Emily Brooks received an unexpected phone call that she will never forget. It was actually after the final round of our final tournament and I played horribly. And I get a call from the talent recruiter at the Golf Channel. I was like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. And I kind of froze. I was like, oh, I don't, was not prepared for this. After arriving in Orlando, Brooks wasted no time immersing herself into the internship. They put me in the instructional department. So I worked with all instructional program and I've taken so many lessons in my life and I know a lot about the golf swing. And only one week in, Brooks was already making a difference. At the end of the first week, they're like, Emily, we're gonna throw you in prompter next week. And I'm like, oh gosh, like this is like the actual show, that this is what they're doing and I'm running prompter and all these people are reading a script at my own pace. So I was like, that's, that freaked me out. And I'm, I'm over here like pre mentally preparing myself to work prompter. Like, you can do it, Emily, you can do it. <laughs> the night before, freaking out. Ended up working it like the whole course of the month. Brooks felt comfortable with any task that she was given, largely due to the experience she had gained during her classes at Elon. So actually last fall I took sports broadcasting with Max Nagan and that was probably the best experience I've had in far as in terms of preparation for it. Um, so like I was we were in the studio, we did all the studio run show, all kinds of stuff, did a live sporting event. And just knowing and knowing a little bit about how things work to help me tremendously. During the course of the internship, Brooks got the opportunity to meet many reputable professionals, including former PGA golfer and television host, David Faraday. I hear him in the background and I'm like, oh my gosh. So I'm taking Snapchats like with David Faraday behind me and I'm like, this is so crazy. And so I go to the control room. Turns out I was talking to Faraday like while I was trying to change the script. I was talking to him and he like knew my name and all this stuff and then Afterwards, I asked producers, like, can I meet him, get my picture with him? And he's like, yeah, of course. So I went out and, like, went out and talked to him for a little bit, got my picture. It was just awesome. And to top it all off, Brooks got her moment of fame, even if only for a few seconds. I'm sitting in the control room about to work prompter, and my supervisor's like, Emily, like, go out, go get in the shot. I'm like, what? Like, no. And he's like, yeah, yeah. So I basically handed Michael Breed a water bottle on TV, and he handed one back to me. I don't really know why, but it was just kind of like, funny because I was like just a little intern in the corner so excited and um, I was on I had my uh, moment of stardom for about three seconds but it, it was awesome and I loved it. Brooks hopes that her successful internship will inspire other student athletes to take advantage of the opportunities at Elon. I think this showed other people and it also showed myself that just like putting in the effort of being like a student athlete and putting in the time and working hard on one sport can open doors for you that you don't know that didn't know they could be open.